Can you believe the former young and the restless star kid, Olivia Allen Lind, is making more money than some of the veteran stars from Y&R? Yeah, exactly, we're shocked as you are. But that's not all, today Cameron Grimes also reveals that the Taraya couple could be in danger, and who's ready to see some awesome soap stars vacation pics. Without any further ado, let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, welcome to Trend Street. In a surprising twist, it turns out that young and restless alum Olivia Allen Lind is pulling in a paycheck that would make even seasoned soap stars raise an eyebrow. TMZ recently reported that Lind, who played Nick and Sharon Newman's daughter, Faith, on The Young and the Restless before her departure in 2021, is now earning a staggering $75,000 per episode for her role in Netflix's upcoming thriller Wayward. With her contract calling for her to appear in at least seven of the eight episodes for the first season, that's about $525,000, a pretty hefty sum compared to the typical daytime soap salary. The new series, created by Canadian comedian Mae Martin and starring Tony Collette, focuses into the dark side of the troubled teen industry. It promises to be a gripping watch, and if it gets picked up for a second season, Lind is set to enjoy a 5% raise, which would bump her per-episode earnings even higher. This impressive paycheck contrasts sharply with the more modest salaries typical in daytime television. With budgets shrinking and production costs rising, many soap stars are seeing their paychecks shrink too. The Young and the Restless has even cut back on the use of elaborate sets, going for more budget-friendly green screens. In this context, Lynn's earnings really highlight the disparity between the pay scales of young rising stars and veteran soap actors. Since leaving Y&R, where Raylan Castor took over her role as Faith, Lind has been on a roll. She's not only appeared on guest spots in shows like Transparent and 911, but she also portrayed a young Dolly Parton in Christmas of Many Colors, Circle of Love. But perhaps most notably, she's been starring in Chucky, the sci-fi series that continues the legacy of the infamous killer doll from the Child's Play movies. Lind's success on Chucky has been nothing short of impressive. For the second season of the show, Lynn's per-episode salary has increased to $73,500, up from $70,000 in the first season. Thanks to a 5% raise built into her contract, she's now making even more money. Over the course of the first season, Lynn earned a substantial $560,000, and she also benefits from back-end royalties from any merchandise featuring her voice or likeness. While some stars have seen their salaries increase over time, many still make significantly less per episode compared to Lynn's hefty paycheck. The amount an actor earns on a soap can depend on various factors, including their tenure on the show, the importance of their role, and their popularity with fans. Take Miss Hale Morgan, for example. Morgan, who has been a beloved part of The Young and the Restless for around a decade, earns upwards of $5,000 per episode and might get cut short according to storylines. Same goes for the soap vet Eric Braden. While he has a net worth of $25 million, according to TV Overmind back in 2020, he makes $5,000 per episode. Eileen Davidson, Sharon Case and Peter Bergman end up making $3,000 per episode in Young and the Restless. While their salary is based on the storylines and popularity, it's still a far cry from the hefty paychecks that new stars like Lind are pulling in. I mean you can just see the gaps. But anyways, we're really happy to see Lind thriving as an actress, and we wish her the best. Meanwhile, Young and the Restless star, Cameron Grimes who plays the role of Mariah Copeland on the show has some new drama for her character. We all know, Mariah and Tessa are in their happy place right now. With baby Arya in the mix, it's a picture-perfect family and their relationship is as smooth as butter. But is something going to shake it up? Well, according to Grimes in an interview with Soap Opera Digest, she's never fond of how soaps often define marriage struggles with cheating, breakups, and makeups. She believes there's a lot of room for more compelling storytelling. I think there are also very real stories that you can tell between people who are committed to each other and stay committed but struggle through something, she said. Grimes wants to test the couple without breaking them up and honestly, that would actually be a good idea. She said, I've heard it from people who have been married for years, decades, that there are periods of time where you just don't like the other person, like you're just not getting along and not seeing eye to eye for whatever reason. I think that's very real and probably hard to navigate. So, hopefully the show listens to Grimes and won't break up Taraya, but bring a new obstacle that they deal with together. What do you guys think? On to the next news, summer is almost out. September 22nd is officially the last day of summer and we're all about soaking up those last rays of sunshine as much as we can. 
just take a look at our favorite soap stars from The Bold and the Beautiful, Days of Our Lives, General Hospital, and The Young and the Restless, who have been flaunting their summer adventures on social media, and it's been a blast following along. Kristen Vaganos aka Molly from GH was chilling in Greece with her family, and Zuleika Silver aka Audra from Y and R was soaking up the Hawaiian sun. Rebecca Budig, you know the new tailor from B&B, found her zen by a peaceful lake, while Kelly Monaco from GH had a cozy hangout with Anthony Geary in Amsterdam. From beachside bliss to city escapades, these stars are wrapping up their summers in style. If you haven't checked out their vacation pics yet, now's the time to see the best way to live the last of the summer days. Number 1. Lisa Lo Cicero Lisa Lo Cicero from General Hospital and her daughter Verity have been living it up across the globe. Their summer included dazzling trips to Paris, Sydney, and a life-changing visit to Bali. Sounds like the perfect summer vacay. Number 2. Jennifer Garice B&B star Jennifer Garice enjoyed a romantic getaway with her hubby Bobby Gassamai and daughter Sofia. They took in a breathtaking sunset at Porto Servo in Sardinia, Italy. Like could there be a more perfect backdrop for family time? Number 3. Elizabeth Hendrickson Y and her star Hendrickson marked her fifth wedding anniversary by revisiting the Caribbean island of St. Bartholomew, where she and her husband Rob Meter tied the knot. We said our vows five years ago on this very island, she shared on her Instagram, making it clear that the love and memories are still as fresh as ever. Number 4. Allison Sweeney The day's star, Sweeney and her family went on an epic safari adventure in South Africa. After two years of planning, Allison couldn't believe she was finally there. Her family was thrilled to see majestic wildlife up close. This was definitely a trip of a lifetime. Number 5. Josh Swickard Swickard took his kids Savannah and Arthur to Disneyland, adding a touch of magic to their summer. Nothing beats a day of fun and thrills at the happiest place on earth. Number 6. Delon de Metz Metz cracked a joke about his trip to Capri, Italy, saying, What, you think I just fell out of a coconut tree, all while sharing stunning photos from his Italian escape? Number 7. Melissa Ordway Ordway soaked up the sun with her family at the beach. Good times and tan lines was her motto as she enjoyed a day of sand and surf with her husband Justin Gaston and their daughters Olivia and Sophie. Number 8. Carson Boatman Boatman celebrated his baby Ava's first vacation at Lake of the Ozarks. It's clear he's cherishing these early moments with his little one in the central Missouri Lake Resort area. Number 9. Tanner Novlin Novlin took his wife Kayla Yule along with their kids Poppy and Jones back to his native Canada for some quality family time. Family time is the best time, he shared, and it looks like they made the most of it. Number 10. Billy Flynn Flynn and his family enjoyed a week in his hometown in Minnesota, and there's nothing like good quality family time. Number 11. Cameron Matheson Matt Hinson had a magical journey through Arizona with his kids. This was a special one because his kids were preparing for exciting new chapters, one heading to London for fashion design and the other to Paris for psychology. Number 12. Jen Lilly Lilly had a blast vacationing in Turks and Caicos with her family and friends. She highly recommends it too. Number 13. Kate Fairbanks Fairbanks and her boyfriend Jay Rudolph took their summer trip to Italy, and it was at the perfect time. Number 14. Ashley Puzimus Lastly, Day's star, Puzimus went for a relaxing vacation at Zayden, a Ritz-Carlton resort in Puerto Los Cabos, Mexico, soaking up the sun and getting those summer tans. So, where did you go this summer? Let us know in the comments down below. Thank you for checking this video out. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for new videos every day. Turn that bell notification on if you want to hear from us and comment down below if you've subscribed and we'll make sure to reply and thank as many of you as we possibly can.